hi here we have the sum of the areas of two circles which touch each other externally is 153 pi if the sum of their radii is 15 find the ratio of larger to the smaller radius so let's say the radii are r1 and r2 so we have r1 plus r2 is 15 and the sum of the areas will be pi r1 square plus pi r2 square which is 153 pi so pi here gets cancelled out we have r1 square plus r2 square is equal to uh, 153 also we have r1 plus r2 is 15 so let's do one thing since we have square over here let's square both these sides so we'll have r1 square plus r2 square plus twice of r1 into r2 is 15 square which is 225 so from here r1 plus r2 square is 153 so we have 153 plus twice of r1 into r2 is 225 so we have twice of r1 into r2 is 225 minus 153 is 47 plus 25 which is 72 so twice of r1 into r2 is 72 and this effectively gives us that r1 into r2 is 72 by 2 which is 36 so we have these two equations that the product of two numbers the two red i is 36 and sum of the two red i is 15. Now if you are good with calculations you can easily figure out that the value of r1 and r2 will be 12 and 3 right 12 into 3 is 36 and 12 plus 3 is 15 but if you are not able to figure that out what we need to do is we need to solve these two by forming a quadratic equation. So how do we form a quadratic equation? We have R1 plus. Instead of R2 here, we can substitute R2 with 36 by R1, which is equal to 15. So we have R1 square. 15 into R1 taken on the left hand side is minus 15 R1 plus 36 is 0. So now effectively we have to do the same thing. Think of two numbers whose sum is minus 15 and the product is 36. So this will be R1 square minus 12 r1 minus 3 r1 plus 36 is 0 or you can use the formula method so from here r1 comes out to be either 12 or 3 so if r1 is 12 in that case sorry so if r1 is 12 in that case r2 must be 3 and if r1 is 3 in that case r2 must be 12 okay so in any case what we need to figure out is the ratio of larger to the smaller radius so the required ratio in any case either this or this the larger radii radius is 12 and the smaller radius is 3 so the required ratio is 4 is to 1 which is option a here correct answer is option a thank you